Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for tomorrow or the next day or whenever it resonates. Because this reading is not time specific and it's not science specific. We're just going to see what comes up. of cups reversed so hmm, this is <laughs> somebody may not be hearing what they want to hear I mean the page of cups reversed this could be a lack of emotion um, it could be there could it could be emotional right now or this could be a lack of emotion um, seven of wands defensive yes somebody may not be feeling loved or somebody could be being I mean this could be a rejection Okay, this could put somebody on the defensive. Somebody could be, you know, pushing somebody away by the looks of things. Somebody could be pushing somebody away. Ten of Cups. Now, tens are a completion. So, I, and what I see here is this could be the completion of a relationship. It could be the end of a relationship. But tens are a completion. So this could be the end of a relationship. This person is pushy, pushing somebody away. It's not love or they don't have feelings for the person anymore or something like that. Mm -hmm. There may be some competition. Okay, this person, the person that is being rejected may have some competition. There's no coming together with this person. It's like it's just not balanced. There's no harmony in this relationship. So that's what this is. I feel like there's there's like really no reason to put effort into this if you if you aren't, you know, somebody may have, you know, tried something with somebody. They may have tried to build a relationship with somebody and it's just not working out. It's I mean the temperance reverse. It's just not coming together as it should it's not meant to be perhaps we got somebody here that is standing their ground push, pushing somebody away this card just fell out eight of cups somebody's been working really really hard putting in a lot of effort but it's still not love no matter how hard you try to make it love you can't force it to be love um, you can't force it you can't you can't we have the Four of Cups here. It's like, it's, this isn't what I want. I want something else. It's, it looks to me like we got somebody here that is focused on something, something else, right? Somebody is focused on something else. It's like they're being offered love. They're something, you know, somebody has feelings for them, but it's not, it's like there's no reciprocation, okay? It's not reciprocal, all right? So I feel like we have somebody here that is finding, you know, their ability to really do what they got to do. Uh, it's like, I got to do this. This isn't love. I have to do this. That's what I see. I, I, I It's not what I want. So somebody, um, oh, we got the King of Pentacles here. This is somebody who acts with integrity. I got to do the right thing. This is somebody who is loyal and noble and, um, this person, um, has a really good character. This person is strong, um, stable, solid, secure, has a lot to offer. This person is looking away though, looking outside. It's like, N I gotta do, I gotta do the right thing. I, this is, I got to do the right thing. So I feel like we have somebody here that is rejecting an offer. They are rejecting an offer. It's just not, it's not stable for me. It's, it's not, it's not meant to be. It's not with the temperance card reverse. It's not. So I think that there's a there's a relationship uh, that is coming to an end because somebody it, it's like I I gotta do the right thing and you know, um, yep yep severing ties severing ties okay five of swords that's what that is. That is what that is. That is severing ties. There's 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 some tension. There is definitely some tension. Somebody is feeling defeated. They're feeling defeated by probably another relationship. You know, it's like, I, I, I know 
that there's something more. I, I know that I know. I know that there is something more. So it feels to me as though that somebody is dealing with a conflict right now. They are. They're dealing with a conflict. It has to do with um, standing their ground. Um, putting in effort to to make something. Make something. It's like they're putting in effort to stand their ground. This person is putting in effort to stand their ground. You know, this could happen. Somebody's working away, and then somebody comes in and, and rejects them. You know, you're working, you don't see it coming. I'm just, I'm not trying to scare anybody or anything, but that's what it looks like to me. It looks like somebody's working away, they're doing their job, they're working, and then it's like all of a sudden there's this conflict and somebody comes in and says, you know, this isn't working for me. Ooh, the devil. This is, this is codependency. This isn't healthy. You know, this is a lost opportunity. Somebody may have, this is very materialistic, and this is very materialistic. Somebody may have been holding on to a relationship for materialistic re reasons. But there's, you know, that's no reason to hold on to a relationship. It feels like we have somebody here who... Uh, is looking at an unhealthy situation and seeing it for what it is. It's almost like they're disgusted. Somebody may be disgusted with themselves even. They may be disgusted with themselves for letting themselves fall victim to something for the, all the wrong reasons, for materialistic reasons. It's not love. It was based on money, greed, obsession, addictions, codependency. So I feel like we have somebody here that it's just, it feels like they're realizing. This is realizing. That's what I feel like this is in this case. I got, I got, I got, this is severing ties. I got to break this. I got to break this bond. Okay. But these are both cards of ego. They both of them are. Somebody's ego has gotten the way of a happy relationship. And now we have somebody that is putting their defenses up. Uh, it's like getting ready to fight, pushing somebody away. This is somebody pushing somebody away because that's not love. It's not love. It's not love. And they may have lost an opportunity with somebody stable, somebody solid, somebody secure, somebody that you know, is loyal and genuine because of their addictions, their codependency, because of their ego. And this is moving on. Somebody is moving on. They got to get out of this troubled situation. I got to get out of this. I got to. I got, I got to get to this better place. I got to get to the other side. I got to get to peace and harmony in my life and wherever they're at it's not peace and harmony it's like that the relationship that they were hanging on to wasn't making them happy and it's like now it feels like now if somebody wants to fight for a relationship this is fighting for a relationship that didn't work out Somebody's going to put, be putting in a lot of effort to fight for a relationship that didn't work out. But they're pushing somebody away. Definitely. So it's like, it feels like it's pushing one away and heading, in a, heading towards another one. No, 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 no. That kind of energy. Ooh, there's been a lack of truth. There's been a lack of communication. Huh. <laughs> There may have been no communication. Somebody may be shutting down communication with the Ace of Swords reversed. Loss of power. 
taking the power away from this unhealthy situation. This is cutting. This is severing ties with an unhealthy situation. It's like taking that power away. So somebody is taking their power, taking the power away from somebody. You know, this could be somebody, you know, that belittled them. This is the five of swords is very belittling. Somebody could be deciding to just shut down everything, shut down this relationship. You know, I'm getting out of here. This is this is too much for me. There's too much disharmony. There's too many ups and downs. There's too much upheaval. There's there's no working together. There's no compromising. Somebody may be dealing with somebody who, you know, they no matter what they say, no matter what they do, they're wrong. You know, you can't win, blah, 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 blah. And it's like, you know, I'm getting out of this. I can't be in this relationship anymore. This, that, this a relationship isn't built on competition. You know, we aren't, we don't need to compete all the time. So it feels, it feels as though somebody is rejecting somebody. They're rejecting somebody. Because it's rejection, because it's unhealthy, it's toxic. It feels like we got somebody here that is... Really putting in effort to break free from something. I, I, I have to. I, that's what I feel. It's like I have to. Um, it's like this isn't... It isn't what I want. If you got somebody here that's looking for more, that's what this is. These two right here, somebody is looking for more. This, it's not what I want. I want something more healthy. Yeah, somebody has made their decision. It's like they see a situation clearly now. That's what the, no more illusion, no more confusion. I got it. I get it. Somebody may be, have been obsessed with proving a point. See the point right here? And there's a, this is this is proving a point, and this is obsession. Somebody may have been obsessed with proving a point, but now there's no more points to be proved. It's like I don't I don't care about proving a point at this point. I just want to be happy, and I want to be real. So I feel like we just have somebody here that receives the clarity, or they come out of some sort of confusion. It's like I know what I gotta do. I have to take action. This is the page of wands. This is a message coming. This is good news. Okay. This is this is where somebody has been getting distracted and and now they, you know, you got to be careful not to get distracted. This is an exciting new opportunity. Somebody may be finding some exciting new opportunity and they got to take action on it. This is somebody who um is, has discovered they have discovered that they made a poor choice. It's like they, they see, this is a visionary, they see that, you know, they were involved in a codependent situation that was built on ego, pride, lust, greed, obsession, codependency, addictions, whatever. This is, this is a discovery or a vision. It's like, and this is realizing, it is, it's coming out of confusion. You know, somebody is realizing. So somebody is going to receive a message from somebody, because this is a messenger. I feel like they're going to receive a message that somebody has found their strength, because there's a lot of strength in this card, to break free from this unhealthy, codependent situation. They've shut down communication. They're no longer communicating. This person has been wanting more, and they see that there is an opportunity for something more. And this person is very disciplined. Somebody is finding the discipline. The King of Pentacles is, is very practical, very disciplined, goal-oriented, loyal, solid, stable. So this man is acts with integrity. So it feels to me as though we have somebody here that is is really about to do something it's like they see a situation clearly and they take action oh my god the lover's card this is this is unexpected it is unexpected this is this is love heals this is making a decision this is probably a, a decision that somebody 
you know, it's like they've been thinking about it for a while. Obviously, they've been thinking about it for a while. But it's like, they, this is a sudden decision, okay? So they've been thinking about it. But then suddenly, it's like, you know, I, I see, I got to do this. Yes, they've been thinking about it for a while. But it's like, all of a sudden, it's like, I got to. I got to. This is an unexpected choice in love. Now, this is also a card of consequences. So somebody may have suffered some sort of consequences for not um, seeing things clearly in the past. Okay? They may have, this could be a lost opportunity. They may have lost a love to somebody else because of their stupidity. Anyhow, um, I feel as though this is, the Page of Wands is good news. I feel like there is um, something that is about to burst into your world unexpectedly. This could be a new lover. This could be a new person. This could, this is somebody that you will probably look up to heaven and say, are you sure? What? 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 Okay. Because it's like, this is like Cupid or Archangel Raphael bringing or whoever, God, universe, whatever, bringing two people together that are meant to be together, but you will question it. You will question it. Now you have to make a choice. And I think that you'll know. You'll know the answer. You will know. There won't, you won't be confused about it. This is a deep connection. It is a deep connection. So I feel like there is a deep connection coming in that you probably were not expecting. I feel like this is sudden movement of some sort. It's like all of a sudden things change. I know this reading has, has changed... Um, it's almost like storylines a little bit. And that's how quickly things change. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Your life can change at the drop of a dime. This is how quickly things change. So something is about to change very quickly. Um, somebody is about to fight for a relationship. Okay? After rejecting somebody. Okay? There's a rejection here. And then this is fighting for, putting in effort into a relationship. I think that they're about to, to head in that direction or head towards, you know, somebody. There's been some sort of crisis, though. This is a crisis. There's been some sort of crisis where somebody had to shut down. They had to shut down communication. They had to cut something out of their life first so that they could move in this direction you know they had to break free from something so i feel as though there is some sort of news that is arriving a message um that is probably going to be surprising i think it is definitely going to surprise the the person on the other end okay the other the person on the other end is going to be surprised that you know this person has contacted them this person um You know, it, it looks as though the per it's going to be like, are you sure? Are you sure this is the right way? Are you sure that I should even do this? You know, that's what I think this is. Somebody has seen the light. Somebody has gained clarity. They have. Somebody has gained clarity. They have gained some wisdom and knowledge through a time of reflection It feels to me as though somebody has been enlightened as to, you know, where they want to take their next path, what road they want to go down. I feel like somebody is about to come out of hiding. Uh, somebody is going to receive a message from somebody that they don't expect, okay? And that is what I got. Good luck.